binding uh, leadoff four pitch walk to Daniel Vogelbach, the villain for the Braves pitchers tonight. Um, two run blast and a couple of walks on Vogelbach's line. And then DJ Stewart smoked a 0 2 mistake fastball up the middle, first and second, no outs. Francisco Alvarez grounded in the pitcher's best friend, twin killing, with some picking and grinning by Austin Riley. Stayed down on a tough hop, third to first for the great, great double dip, much needed. And then got Rafael Ortega to ground out to Orlando to lock it down, slam the door. Absolutely incredible stuff. And then uh, the offensive output, Super Rosario and Big Bear. Again, uh, <laughs> bears are quickly becoming my favorite animal, and I think they're becoming the Braves pitcher's favorite animal this homestand because Marcelo Zuna, Eddie Rosario, Hunter and Dancing Bobcat on the surface of the sun. Um, single by Marcelo Zuna, 115 miles an hour in the second. Then Eddie Rosario got a hang and change up and obliterated it. Two roses into the chop house. Absolutely crushed. Uh, two nothing. And then the big spot of bother for Bryce Elder. He worked his butt off tonight, but really, really good. Respect your elders. But the big spot was uh, bases loaded. One out in the fourth after a pitching, pitcher's violation walk. And I think that stuck in his crawl a little bit on Lindor. Uh, hit Pete Alonzo with the next pitch. Walked Vogelvok. And then big time battle with DJ Stewart. Uh, the so bad it was good slider, the high slider, struck him out swinging, and then uh, got Francisco Alvarez to fly out to uh, Money Mike on the eighth pitch of an at bat there. Um, so really, really good stuff to battle through that inning, 33 pitches, but uh, the most important, zero runs. And then in the fifth, Marcelo Zuna, um, a rainbow moonshot absolutely torched it. 3 nothing. there was gold at the end of the rainbow. An extra run, tic-tac-toe, 3 nothing. And then big play uh, in the sixth after giving up a leadoff double to uh, Francisco Lindor. Just a league fastball on two strikes. And then um, Jeff McNeil swinging butt on a 3-1 count. And Bryce Elder was out, able to pounce on that quick as a cat and able to get him out there. A fantastic play. Pitchers or athletes on that one. Really huge because it would have been first and second no outs with Pete Alonzo coming up instead of runner and second. One out. Pierce Johnson comes in, strikes out Pete Alonzo on three consecutive curveballs. Throw it again, throw it again, throw it again. See you later. Even though he got an assist from Manny Gonzalez on the second one. But we all we always accept gifts. Unfortunately, hung one to Vogelbach and he torched it. Center field, two run blast. But then he was able to come back, strike out DJ Stewart. Um, and then Joe Jimenez, one, two, three, easy breezy. Two strikeouts, AJ Minter gave up. Uh, Dunker, Dunker, flare single to Jeff McNeil. Jeff McNeil is starting to become annoying again. The annoying pesky hitter uh, that he always is against the Braves. Sing, uh, single with two outs after two really quick outs on Nimmo and Lindor. And then he was able to get Pete Alonzo to pop out to um, Matt Olson in that threat after a stolen base. So really, really huge. Uh, the, night, the night shift, the bullpen, whatever you want to call them. Have been amazing lately. Pitching, carrying the torch. This homestand, you gotta love it. Clutch hitting from Super Eddie Rosario and Marcelo Zuna is on his way to a player of the week already. Absolutely scorching. Big Bear, Eddie, love you. Go for the series win tomorrow. And another day off the calendar. Magic number down to 25. As always, go Braves champions forever.